Hey lifestylers, I'm back with all the latest in lifestyle. I know you missed me so I couldn't stay away for too long. But here's the scoop. Trending this week, Little Nala now has a baby brother. Baby number two for Halle Berry is a boy who the actress and hobby Olivia Martinez dubbed Maceo Robert. He was born last Saturday. And here's a little keeping up with the Kardashians for you. Chris, the family matriarch and husband Bruce Jenner have separated. After 22 years of marriage, the two have decided that they can be better off as friends. Can't say we didn't see that one coming. Many are saying TVJ and its affiliate stations are just spoiling the voice for the fans and Tess and Chin, our local contestant. On Monday, Jamaicans were outraged at the fact that TVJ, who bought the rights to the series, aired a delayed broadcast. To add insult to injury, on Tuesday, RE TV, which should have carried the broadcast live, experienced technical difficulties, causing the viewers to miss a whole chunk of the show. Please, Get it together for next week, TVJ. Sky Lounge was launched at Villa Ronai on Tuesday night. It was a fabulous event, and we would be remiss if we didn't bring you the highlights. So, here goes. Dr. Sarah Lawrence is a new face of L'Oreal in the Caribbean. The former Mr. Maker World has been promoting L'Oreal products here and in the region. Way to go, Sarah. November is food month, so join the Gleaner for all the scrumptious news leading up to and during that month. And speaking of scrumptious, Restaurant Week was launched last week at City Life Ministries in Kingston Southside. There were lots of great menus to sample and palettes were ignited all around. On a road this week, the Gleaner sponsored Restaurant Week 2013. Hey fellow lifestylers, Garfin here. We're at Restaurant Week 2013 and we're doing it like only we can on Lifestyle today. It has been an amazing experience. The patrons are here, the kids are here. City Life Ministries in Southside, downtown Kingston. It can't get any better than this. Food, fun, friends and frolic. Enjoy. Stick and stay to Lifestyle Today where we got it all covered for you. has chosen to lend our support to City Life Ministries. When Stephanie and Daniel came and they were they mentioned Restaurant Week, we all know Restaurant Week over the last few years. But for me, and as we sat down and spoke about it, the reason why we're here tonight, everybody, is because, because of vision, yes, but because Restaurant Week is really more than food. And food is more than just what we can consume. Food is what we see happening here, which is fellowship with each other, relationship, relationship, relationship. Oh my God, it's absolutely fabulous. Fabulous location, you know. This is out of the norm, not what you'd expected. And my God, you walk in and you're just met by all of these beautiful people. The host, you have these fabulous ladies going around offering you drinks. The atmosphere, it's just simply superb. What does it mean for you to be a Restaurant Week ambassador? How exciting is it for you? I mean, okay, I see it's like, there's, there's a lot, I really love my belly guy, I feel like, seriously. But, I mean, how do they know? It was, it's just like the best thing that has ever happened to me. But, I mean, I'm very excited. I, I look forward to Restaurant Week every single year. People who know me, I do lunch, Nyaman School, 
program dinner every day restaurant week is me so I'm um, to be an official ambassador it's kind of I feel like I was ambassador a long time but now it's official it's been fantastic I go to restaurant week every year and I go to at least three restaurants I have to I love food I'm a foodie people don't think I'm a foodie but I love food but um, I I'm really looking forward to this one this year. I'm big to the Gleaner because apart from the fact that Jenny's loud and the Gleaner is loud and everywhere, I'm looking forward to be, it being bigger, better than it has been. And what I thought was very interesting was a launch in the ghetto. Make we call it so, because a ghetto. And what I think is beautiful is how they appreciate it, is how all of this restaurant week will be going beyond knife and fork. It'll be going beyond the platter to lives. Tired, 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 but restaurant we launched 2013 was a success. Terry, how was it for you? Listen, we have bowled, we played bas um, baseball, basketball, tennis, we've done the Wii, we've done hula hoop dancing, and the, the children, they really were a treat, and the Gleaner is always going to be proud to be a part of something like this. So guys, you just remember that for restaurant week, just make sure that you go to go-jamaica.com slash rw, and you will get a listing of all the participating restaurants as well as their discounted deals. Check it out, guys. We had a great time. I'm they, gonna go hula hoop. There you have it. I'm your host, Garfina, and that's Terry Carell, and that's it for the rest launch of Restaurant Week 2013. And finally, I have a bit of bad news. We have to take a break for just a few weeks, but here's the upside: we'll be back with a new set, new segments, and a new look. So look out for us in November because we'll be back to make your life and your style that much more fabulous. So until November, see you guys and always keep in mind that life in style is lifestyle. <laughs>